I'm sure you noticed I have not jumped on the live we had a very last minute replacement and as in show business we're just doing the best we can and getting ready for the show it's gonna be an awesome performance it's tonight. gonna be so good <laughs> So it's our last weekend here in Chicago at the CIBC Theater. We are so sad to go, but I chased some of the queens down and we want to give you some of our best of Chicago things. Best fast food place. Portillo's, hands down. Anything from Portillo's is incredible. Okay. Olivia, mm -hmm. what is your best of Chicago? Um, Definitely the jazz showcase. Ah, the best jazz music in town. And the sofas, and the drinks, and the jazz. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Adidas. Do you have a Do you have a favorite jazz song, Olivia? All of me. Why not take all of me? Yes. Baby, can't you see? That's my favorite one. Actually, this is the one that I knew first. Oh, you're the best. Thank you. Kelly, what's the best sushi in Chicago? Sushi Sun. <laughs> Didi, what's your best of? My best of, um, I like the sidewalks because people would like play music and it would be fun. Like live music? Yeah. Okay, I'm adding best yoga place, and that is the space between. Jasmine, what's your best of? I loved walking around Millennium Park and Maggie Daly Park and basking in the sun. Yes. <laughs> Aaron, tell me about the best coffee in Chicago. So, when you're talking buying beans, I have a new bottle and it opens up. Aaron, <laughs> what's the best coffee in Chicago? Okay. So, if you're looking to buy just beans to grind and make at home, you should go to Dollop or Hero Coffee and get a bag of beans. I got a whole bag of beans. And you can take them home and ground them and make French press. If you want a fancy drink, you have to go to Goddess and the Baker. There's a million of them. And uh, one of my favorites is on Madison. And another one of my favorites is on Wabash. 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 Anyway, you can go and you can get a glittery latte or lavender latte or a uh, they did rainbow tea, lattes for pride rainbow rainbow lattes basically any and tea drinks too golden milk latte anyway one of my favorite things that ha they had there was a specialty drink that had cayenne and honey and ginger and it was spicy but also coffee hey princess queen you got this today you got this. <laughs> You're looking good too. All right, bye. Um. So Kelsey and and I are we walked out the stage door because we Aaron like, was we'll on his out. car. Let's just go out. Let's we're, we're just gonna go out. I'm literally eating a salad, <laughs> and, and we walk out. Legit. Like there are people, like a sea of people, and they cheered when we walked out. And I'm literally, I said as we walked out, because Erin said, are you sure you don't want to go out through the front? Because I, I, I said, I'm eating a salad. She said, she said, are you sure you don't want to go out the, the front door? And I said, I me, mean, no matter where I go. Yeah. I'm literally eating my words right now. Hello! <laughs> this is our superstar alternate, Erin. 
new bangs up because pin curls don't help with bangs. <laughs> she got new bangs today, which you saw in the video that we posted. Um, what a what a unique Instagram takeover today. <laughs> it certainly was a real live day in the real world of Sixth Musicale um, over at the CIBC Theater. This is our closing weekend. We have had a blast in Chicago. We're so grateful to everybody that has come and supported us. And we look forward to seeing you all on tour. I'm going to add my handle. You can follow me at Cassie M. Silva. I'll add Aaron's little handle. And, um, and also, thank you to everybody who joined us for the live. We had so much fun. And it also was really nice to be able to answer some of your questions there and to connect with you and also those that were at the stage door. And, yeah, thanks so much. And now we're going to watch Stranger Things.